uh, after further consultation, consultation with the National Security Committee uh, this afternoon, uh, tonight we will be resolving uh, to move to a position where a travel ban will be placed on all non-residents, non-Australian citizens coming to Australia, and that will be in place from 9 p.m. tomorrow evening. Um, we have already seen a very significant reduction in the travel uh, to Australia by non-citizens and residents. It's about a third of what it normally would be at this time of the year, and we've seen reductions even in, in the last few days when we put in place the uh, bans uh, which, innate, which required people to self-isolate for 14 days. And so as a result of that decision, we've seen that the, the uh, traffic reduce quite significantly, and we believe it is essential now to take that further step uh, to ensure that we now no longer will be allowing anyone, unless they're a citizen or, or a resident or a uh, direct family member in those cases, as is applied to all the other travel bans we've put in place previously. Now, for Australians, of course, they will be able to return and they will be subject, as they already are, to 14-day isolation uh, upon arrival back in Australia. Now, the reason for this decision is consistent with the decisions we've already made on this issue, and that is we now have around 80 per cent of the cases we have in Australia uh, that are either a result of someone who has contracted the virus overseas or someone who has had a direct contact uh, with someone who has returned from overseas. So the overwhelming uh, proportion of cases in Australia have been imported. And the measures we've put in place has obviously had an impact on that. And this is a further measure now uh, that will ensure that that uh, can be further enhanced.